While the World Meteorological Organization investigates weather extremes all across the planet, their effort here is very critical to determining exactly how much, how fast the climate is changing and evolving. The knowledge of extremes establishes some of the baselines, and that allows for better understanding of environmental patterns across the globe. Tropical cyclone Freddie is currently under investigation for possibly being the longest lived tropical system in history. Let's bring in one of the experts on the team for these investigations. Randy Servini, thank you so much for being with us. You're a professor at ASU. Um, you work on the extreme records for the WMO. They put your title as a rapporteur. Is that correct? Is that how you uh, introduce uh, someone who works on these investigations? Yes, uh, the, 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 the rapporteur is a person that uh, is in charge of uh, a particular project for the United Nations or the World Meteorological Organization. So I actually run this uh, extremes project. We put together uh, teams of international scientists to evaluate the data, to carefully go over all of the information to make sure that everything was recorded properly, that the right equipment was used, that uh, the measurements were made correctly. And with Freddie, it's been an interesting uh, particular situation because it crossed all the way from Australia to Africa. And we're talking 8,000 miles. That's the distance uh, of almost three times the, the, uh, the distance across the United States. So it traveled for an incredibly long uh, distance and an incredibly long time. The current record is 31 days. And we're evaluating to see if this storm actually lasted longer than that. So the 31 days, that was John back in 94, uh, maybe I think it was. And there have not been many storms that have traversed the Indian Ocean like this. This could be, I, I think, you put fourth on the list. What will make it official? How long until you can say the record has been broken? Well, uh, we have just obtained what's called the best track data, the very uh, uh, finely resolved information on the exact plotting of the position and the time of Hurricane Freddie from its beginning to its end. Uh, we had to, to work to make sure that the Australian data matched up with the data from the uh, off the coast of, of Africa, which is from uh, Reunion. It's a small island that's owned by uh, France. And now we're in the process of evaluating to determine well, one of the things is how, uh, whether it was a hurricane or not all the time that it was across the, the uh, uh, Indian Ocean. That, uh, we have to make sure that its tropical uh, cyclone status uh, is properly evaluated. Uh, it, it gets a little involved, but we always like to make sure that uh, we have the exact right data in order to make these, these calls on what is a record or not. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.